Hello everybody, welcome to Impressive Image Maker channel. This is Toshi Yagi from beautiful little island Okinawa, Japan. Uh, I'm a photographer, I shot this product shot for a long time ago. Well, I shot a reversal film, of course color, but uh, this is black and white I found. It. And this is my subject today. And well, I'm going to try something different, creative image. Well, well, let's get started. Now I have this image, and also I made this pencil drawing type image by Adobe Photoshop Use Filter Code. Find edges, as always. Well, I, I don't know, this is pretty nice lighting, isn't it? And, uh, well, this is my specialty long time ago, the tabletop shot, and I love the lighting. Well, uh, I'm gonna make, I don't wanna break this lighting or effect or anything. I, I wanna make a duplicate layer, then I'm gonna keep on this base image, turn it off, then well, I'm gonna smudge this image first, then let's see how it's gonna turn out. Okay, now, I have... Well, usually use I, this Evolve. That makes a real nice texture, I think. Well, I found this brush, so you don't have to change. This is nice design here too. Well, this is... What I'm doing is creative image, so it's not for product. It's for image, right? So I'm gonna break this nice design of it. You don't have to keep this, right? If it's for commercial, then no, you gotta show this designed nicely. But this time, let's create something different. How can I make that? Spoons are mostly difficult to lighting because of this hole. You've got to have this block somewhere else. Anyways, because we have the lens to shoot. It's gonna re reflect, right? Well, looks like something crayon type drawing. Now, this is black and white, so I may Paint some, okay, smudged Pro, uh, main subject. Now, let's see the outside. This black slate, that's a good props. Used so many times. The shape of the black slate is so cool. Well, you don't have to smudge everything, but Maybe make outside. Okay, now smudging all the way. Now what I can do is, let's see, change this blend mode top of this pencil drawing type image. Let's see, usually do just change to darken so you can see through underneath of the image and but this time I just want to check. Let's see if I can change this anything happens. No, nothing. Maybe overlay it's lighten up, tone down 
Subtract. That's pretty interesting. That's cool, huh? Well, what do you think about painting colors? Some? Maybe. Okay, let's see. Just leave this pencil joint tab image. Add layer for color. Change the blend mode to color. Then leave this pencil drawing type image. Let's see, overlay and opacity 50%. Then let's paint on this layer 4. Like usually I add when I use the watercolor type image, I usually add some kind of dark blue on shadow area. So now I'm going to change the brush, um, airbrushing to maybe soft airbrush, real softly. Just try and see some. How about brown, yellowish? Well, some kind of color, colorize. Let's see, this is color, right? Hey, look at this. Divide. Make something living here, looks like. Well, let's change, subtract. Hmm. I kind of like here this expression. Some, yeah. But the color is, yeah. Well, how about duplicate this layer? Then just keep the color base and I'm going to change this. Let's see, divide, was it? If I turn this one off, it shows more. So, in this case, I'm going to make, make mask, then invert mask. Now, reveal with soft airbrush, bigger size. Use the white to reveal this area, right? Now, first, you're going to see this somebody's living type then i'm gonna make mask black to hide on this mask so it shows this light more because i'm just hiding on this image layer but showing this layer mask with different blend mode just combined together see wow that's interesting some kind of accent yeah then let's see now I'm going to use this base image, bring this one go all the way top, then make, well, make mask, then invert mask. Now I'm going to reveal same way, just a touch, show this in design too. Thank you. 
Yeah, let's see about this much. This is the one. Then let's see. It's a really nice effect. Now I'm gonna make mask on this base image. By the way, this is the this mask, right? And I'm gonna make mask on this. Then I'm gonna invert. Now I'm gonna find something interesting brush. Yeah, let me see heavy metal. Hmm. No. Just clear mask. Now invert again. Find some different one. Artistic. Lalapuna. Hmm. This one makes different effect. That's interesting too. First time find out. Look at this. It's changed. But when you go real dark, then it shows up. Hmm, that's interesting, huh? Lalapuna. Hmm. That's I guess it'll work. Darker goes to more shows same way. So in this case maybe use black some kind of balance, huh? Well this is okay why well, I'm gonna reveal this base image too. Uh, it's gotta be smooth, huh? Let me see. Mm, I'm gonna use airbrushing soft, soft airbrush, real softly. Shows straight image. No smudge on this steel surface. Gotta be smoothed out, right? Okay. Well, nicely squarish. Okay. I'm gonna make um, reveal this mask again with the uh, artistic to Larapuna. Now it's squarish. Yeah. Well, I guess this is it for today some different image well thank you for watching my video and uh, i hope this movie is going to show um, some kind of idea for your creative work and i really appreciate for you guys support and uh, you guys have a nice day see you next time bye now ciao